All right, if you're looking to figure out how to get a Windows Server installation USB, this is for you. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm going to just run a tool called Rufus. So if you don't have this downloaded, just Google, Bing, whatever it is you do, Rufus. <laughs> It creates bootable USB or installer USBs for you. I've already got this in my box, so I'm going to run Rufus. And then from here, I'm going to go ahead and launch it up and select an ISO. I've already pre-downloaded the Windows ISO, so I'm going to do select. And I'm going to do, for me, server 2019 right now. And notice when it does this, it auto-selects GPT. That could be fine, but just kind of a pro tip here, depending on what system you're installing this on, that might not work because this is going to require a UFI firmware. And the system I actually install for my test machines doesn't support that. So I'm actually going to select MBR. It'll change it back to BIOS or UFI, and this will work. From here, I'm going to hit start. I already had a USB drive plugged in. It's gonna warn me. Hey, are you sure it's gonna delete everything? Yeah, go for it, why not? And off to the races it goes. If it's the first time you've run Rufus, you'll probably get a pop-up uh, about downloading some additional files. Just hit yes, and other than that, you now have a bootable installation. Works for Windows, works for Linux, works for a lot of things. Off you go.